Because if lobsters do it, then there is something that we can read about humans from that. There's not one line in that entire book that's, that claims that, because it's not what I believe. Most human hierarchies, as I already pointed out, are hierarchies of competence, not power. So if you want to be a successful man, then you should be competent, and that will move you up the hierarchy, and that will make you attractive, and for good reason, unless you want an incompetent mate, which is possible and, and, and happens, but isn't something that I would recommend. People will sometimes choose an incompetent mate because they're intimidated by competence. And so they'll settle for someone who they don't respect because they feel that they can master them and they won't be intimidated. But it's not a recipe for a happy life, I can tell you that. There's not a line in the book and there's nothing in anything I've ever said that suggests that. Okay, but if, if so many people are getting the same misapprehension, could it... But it has absolutely nothing to do with what I wrote or what I've said or what I believe. I don't believe that our fundamental hierarchies are based on power. I don't believe that the way that you move up our hierarchies is as a consequence of manifesting power.